Hello, hello, hey, hello, hello. <laughs> hey y'all, happy new year. I'm so glad that this is my first video of the year. Um, but before I start, just comment down below videos that you would like to see me do for 2020. Um, you know, be specific or specific on what type of trial and hauls you like to see and maybe even the other stuff because with the new year blossoming, it's always great to have um, new things and um, I have something else to say. Oh yeah, so I got some clothes from Silhouette Styles and I wanted to talk about that. So quick, quick review. Everything fits pretty good. But one complaint I have is that shipping was terrible. I ordered on Black Friday and I was so excited because I've ordered from this place before and um, it was great because the owner is a black woman and I love to buy from black owned companies. It just makes me so happy. But, ooh child, that bath and body work, berry waffle cone candle smells so good. But anyways, the shipping was terrible. Ordered on Black Friday. I got it like on New Year's Day or New Year's Eve. That is ridiculous. And the shipping was only supposed to take like three days. It took more than a month. But besides that, I got everything. And let's get into it. Yeah, my name is Daisy and they call me crazy. Qu -qu -qu crazy. <laughs> I don't know why, but this cute little top <clears throat> from Silhouette Styles, it just makes me feel really bubbly and make me wanna like dance, dance, dance. <coughs> but um, yeah, in my other video, I tried this on a little thong thong, but YouTube hates me, child. But anyways, uh, it's just a simple zigzaggy, zigzaggy top. Um, I have to be really confident if I were to wear this in public. Like, I would probably wear this at a bar. I've never been to a bar, but maybe I'll go to a bar one day. Who knows? But I would wear this to the bar with like a cute pair of jeans and a cute purse. Like very like 90s kind of style though. Because 90s, like 90s fashion is definitely coming back in and I love it. I just hope we can bring back 90s hair with like the cute blowouts. Ooh, I got scared because my robe dropped. I was like, what is that? What is my robe? Um, like with cute little blowouts and stuff like that. Like, you know, like Aaliyah hair and da 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 da. And uh, I just love the 90s. I didn't get to experience it. I was born in 97. <laughs> but yeah, just has this simple frills. So here's the front. Here's the side. And these jeans, I got them a while ago. I have not worn them in public because of the back. And here is the back. <laughs> you see these jeans like, what? <sighs> they were such a good idea until I saw this. But anyways, let's get into the next outfit. It's just gonna be a top. This is gonna be the last top. And then we're gonna get into the cute little two pieces. And also this is super stretchy, like very stretchy and comfortable, but also I don't have big tits, so. <laughs> Do you see the nails? <laughs> I got these neon pink nails, just because I really wanted something neon pink. And it just goes so cute with this top. I definitely see myself wearing this with like some high-waisted baggy kind of pants. Well, not baggy, but like I have my vision. And with just like a whole 90s look, okay? Really cute, very 90s, like just period, okay? <laughs> and it just is, right now, the current fashion that's in is this, one shoulders. And I love it because I like to let my armpits have a breath to, Breathe in, breathe out, okay? And definitely you cannot wear a bra with this, but luckily, you know, I got some perky tatas, so I don't have to worry about that. And it's a very stretchy material. I definitely would hand wash this because I feel if I, if I put this in the washing machine, it's gonna get nip -ally. Okay, so here's the front, here's the side, and here is the back. 
Now, let's get into my favorite part, two-piece sets. Okay, this next piece is so cute and it definitely, I don't know if this is actually an error, era. I don't know if people actually wore this in the 90s, but I just thought this was so cute. It's called the stallion set because, you know, I'm stats like a stallion. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I just realized while trying it on for the second time that the zipper goes like this, or it can. So I can wear it like this to be conservative. But then if I'm feeling real spicy, hot tamale, you know, I can do this, you know? And even the size of it, I can do that for whatever reason, if anyone wants to do that. <coughs> But this is super cute. Um, <clears throat> hmm. So this part fits really great. Now this part, it fits fine, but y'all know I am a stickler, stickler when it comes to the booty part, okay? So we're gonna get to that in a second. But here's the front, here's the side, and here's the back. So I do think this is a piece that I would wear a lot, a lot. I just really don't like this part and the reason why is that the cuff, the cuff of the stallion booty is being cut off, okay? And that is not okay in any way, shape, or form. You cannot cut off a stallion's booty. So I wish that there, I don't know how people do it, but that could be fixed. That should be arranged. But it's really hard because everybody's body is different, but cater to the stallions. Yeah, your last new, but he ain't doing it like the stallion. <laughs> okay, anyways, let's get to the next two piece. We're doing hot pink, like Doja Cat. Because I look like Doja Cat. Call me Doja Fox. I keep it juicy, juicy. I get that much. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. 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 I did that on purpose because I'm trying to be cool. I'm trying to be aesthetic -y, you know? I'm trying to be like a Tumblr and, and TikTok girl. Anyways, yes, when I wear this, I feel like that. Um, I really love like Juicy Couture and like Juicy Couture pink suits and stuff like that. Pink is not my favorite color, y'all. Blue is, but I do love the color pink and I feel like it makes you feel bubbly. It makes you feel really cutesy, and it and it does give me like that early two thousands vibe. Like I feel like I'm Regina George's mom and saying, "I'm a cool mom." Like I feel like that. I feel like that, and I just feel so cute in this. Um, now, what I will say is, the quality is not the best, but you get what you pay for. I definitely would not wash this in a dryer in a washer. <laughs> I wouldn't wash this in a dryer either, but I would not machine wash this. You really need to hand wash this because I can tell by the material that it's going to be very sensitive. But I am going to be wearing the heck out of this. Now, neon colors excite me, but neon colors do scare me too because I'm always scared I'm going to, you know, get some chicken sauce, get some pad thai on this and i'll be so sad but this is one size fits all and one thing i will say is i think maybe the one size fits all might work for the top it's kind of loosey like it's like kind of a size medium thing going on but these pants no mm -mm. it is it is stretchy it is very stretchy okay but all that matters is that it fits me so here's the front Here's the side, and here is the back. Now with this, when you wear colors like this, it's gonna be showing every cellulite, every little bump and crevice you got on your booty. I will say, you know, the booty meat right here, it could be a little bit better. 
you know it could be it could have a little bit more air on the cups but i do really like this i do not think that it can be squat approved i would be very scared but to be honest with this kind of clothes i would not work out in these these are like on the go cutesy kind of clothes and guess what my nails match my nails match i ain't even trying to do that i'm like doja cat okay like hot pink i would sing some of her songs right now but youtube will trip for some reason about people singing songs like if you're just singing songs just in a video they'll be like oh 25 percent of the one dollar you made from your video is going to that person and that ain't happening. I work too hard for my work, okay? Love you, Doja Cat, though. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm wearing gray. It's gray sweatpants season, y'all, okay? Okay. Um, so it's winter here in the States, if you don't know. I think this is a size small, I think. Everything I got in a, either a size small or one size, okay? But this is something that I would realistically wear if I were to go outside. Because most of the time, the only time I go outside is to get food, get my nails, my hair done, and to go back to St. Louis. So I do need to up my wardrobe, which I will in 2020. Watch out because I have a birthday haul coming up and I got other stuff coming up because, you know, January 17th. I'm a Capricorn, and I'm a Capo, Capo, Cap, Cap. Okay, anyways, so I love gray. It makes the butt look mwah, chef's kiss. So I had to get this. And it's like a regular, very thin, like, I don't know what kind of blend it is, but it's a blend that isn't uncomfortable, not itchy. I will remove the tag in the back though. I will be cutting that the heck off because it is irritating me okay so <laughs> here's the front here's the side and what i really like about this is the neon now if it didn't have these neon little thing things i would not have gotten it but i like the little neon thing things so now i need to get some neon thing thing sneakers so you know we can have that little neon thing thing going on and this is just like a really cute going to tarjay kind of look okay and now here is the back Hit it from the back, 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 back. Oh, and you can see it from the, see it from the, oh, oh, whoa. okay. So this is super cute and it is comfortable. And if I say this for last, because look, the cuff, I got it. You see, ain't no restraints. I'm like a bird. Thank you guys for watching and i'll let you guys get a close-up of gray sweatpants season and i love y'all and i'll see you on the next go mm. Mm, 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 mm.